Hey guys, welcome back to Bambi TV. Guys, we're going to be reacting to Kristen Hawkins versus the angriest pro choicer ever. Guys, let's get straight into this. It's disgusting, and you should be damn ashamed of yourself, and I don't believe that, and I'm not going to fight until people like you do not have a place to come on here on my campus that I paid a school to go to and spew your fucking lie. I have a personal question for mm. you. Mm -hmm. Are your beliefs about um, abortion and life and conception that, does that have anything to do with your personal religious beliefs? Your belief that life being a conception that is not shared by mm -hmm. a lot of people. It's not shared by me. It's not shared by any of my friends. So I'm asking you, why should your moral belief be the end all be all and make the law and take away the right to a scene of clean, safe, abortion for women to have. And the fact that you can sit here and say that the rapist baby, the seed or whatever you want to call it, the baby that's still in your belly and that it's not born yet, that you should be forced to have that, it's disgusting. And the fact that you can come over here and have an entire career based off of this, and I'm not done speaking. And then you can sit here in front of my friend who was a victim of rape and say that she should have that baby, it's disgusting. And you should be damn ashamed of yourself, and I don't believe that, and I'm not going to fight until people like you do not have a place to come on here on my campus that I paid a school to go to and spew your fucking lies. Well, I believe in the First Amendment. Do you believe in the First Amendment? Do you? Do you believe in the First Amendment? I've allowed you to sit here and scream at me for an hour and a half and I'm and saying I don't believe that you should have the right to take away my access to a clean, safe abortion as a human right. I have the right to have the autonomy over my own body. You have the right to your autonomy over your own body. We both get knocked up, have sex, both of us pregnant. You want to abort it? You don't want to abort it? Your decision. Mm -hmm. If I want to abort it, I'm going to fucking do that. Okay. So who are you to sit here yeah, and so tell me Yeah, so I don't want to own a slave, that, that. but you want to own a slave. Am I supposed to just sit around and say that? Do not okay? sit here in front of a microphone and compare owning a slave to me, you white That's fucking bitch. You have no idea to sit here and say this shit to me. Ma'am, that is the argument you just made. No, it's not. Is no, it is not. Argument. That is your incorrect interpretation. That is a logical fallacy. That you is you the think argument. you can sit here and go ring around the rosy with me? that is the me? argument. Are you done with your question? Because you asked me like... You haven't things. answered anything. You've actually you just made a statement and completely anything. deterred my argument right, in a completely different down, way. Oh, do you question. think that you can own a slave? If I want to own a slave, can I own a slave? How can you sit here with a straight face and say that to me? Aren't you? How is you not embarrassed of yourself? Okay, can you let me answer your question? How can you sit here and deny biology? This How can you sit here and deny biology? I'm going to ask you the same question. Do you want me to answer your questions? If you will sit down, I will answer your questions. I want, no, I'm going to stand right here and I okay, want you well, to you tell me how you me think it's so okay to compare questions. owning a slave to having an abortion. Yes. It yes. is not even in the same ballpark. Yes. Because white people were not seen as people in this country. Yes, they were just enslaved. like what you've done time and time again tonight to an unborn child. You have argued. Unborn you child, are, not living. You all, black people already existed. They were born. Unborn they were children are like, living, literally man. born into slavery. Would you like me to answer your questions? I can't answer if you keep screaming at me. Do you want me to answer your questions? I'm waiting. Are you going to stop Are talking? you going to answer my question? Yes. Or are you going to sit here and look stupid? I'm quiet right now. I'm quiet. This is why we have the First Amendment, so they can Am I do speaking? This. So, no. When we talk about abortion, we talk about the living human being that's present inside of a mother's womb. Biology t confirms this fact. This is not a religious belief that I hold. This is a scientific fact. The law of biogenesis says like begets like. We know the definition of life, and we know what's inside of a mother is living because that, ch that child is growing. You can call the child a fetus, a clump of cells, whatever, but the fact is that entity, which is a member of our human species, because I, two humans, can't reproduce anything other besides a human, is in fact alive. The arguments that you're making to support your extremist beliefs to justify abortion. It's not abortion extremist. Is it's that basic human right that you're trying to take away from me. doesn't have value. The argument you're trying to and failing to make in the argument that you really You don't get to sit here and tell me what my on. argument is. If you want to answer my question, then answer my question. Ma'am, you said you'd be quiet. Answer the, the question. The argument you're failing to make and what you argument you should be making is that you believe that the human inside of the womb has less value than a woman. And that certain people get yes, to Yes, it does, because it's her exactly. body, her choice. Exactly. Her body, that exactly. Is her body, her choice. Yeah, that is your argument. Sorry, it is not that it's not a human being or that's, that's living, because that's flat out denying biology. 
We know it's living, and we know it's a human being. What else? What you you're mean? arguing is that, that that child doesn't have the same right to life as his or her mother, because you have decided. What you said during your comments mm -hmm. was that if I got pregnant and chose not to have an abortion, I can do that. But you can choose to have abortion because mm -hmm. the mother gets to decide the value of that person. The mother. That is it's exactly, the mother's child. That's damn, exactly what you're I'm not saying. only answer your question. That's exactly Shut what up. happened. That's exactly what happened in pre-Civil War America. You can choose to assign value to black Americans depending on what you felt like. You could say, oh, wow. I am against slavery because I know wow. these people are human beings that have value and no one has the right to own another human person. But if I was a plantation owner in the South, There's I could no say, yeah, they have life. some value, but they don't people have like full value because I, I like deem it. It's a Twitter. slippery slope. <laughs> And that is not, by the way, that is not a religious belief. This is a scientific belief that this is a human being. Where we can differ on our belief is the value can I ask a we assign. No, there's other people behind you. The value that you're assigning to me. That is the actual me. debatable question here today. No, is what it's is not. the value we assign to human beings in the womb? Does a human being in the womb have the same value, Are you gonna stop the same going right to and life and around and around as other people, yourself? or do they not? That is the true pro-abortion argument. And if you would have taken an hour to research, you could have come and made. But you failed can to I do ask that because you deny now? biology. Can Next I ask my person. question No, now? you can get behind the line. Back the you line. can sit here and you can like, get try the back and create the line. She's been waiting an idea that you have of what we believe in and push it back in my face, but it's not going to work. Your you little get the back logical the fallacy ring around the rosy will not work on us. You disgust me. And if right, biology. She's been waiting to speak, ma'am. You're, you're not allowing other women to speak. Suck it. Guys, the fact that she's being stupid that she doesn't know is just, it's just stupid. Like, I hate it. I feel the craziest thing you can see is someone going down the drain and really like he's heading up. Like, that, that's, that's stupid and it's fucked up. But no matter how you try to convince the person, like, it's going to just be great so you need to like understand the fact that, oh, I'm going down because Right now, she doesn't even, she's not even trying to consume the knowledge that is being passed to her. She, she just believes what she thinks is right and is right. But she made the point, I wouldn't like, like what Jonathan Peterson said. He was like, he does not believe people are villains. Like, he believes people have good and bad sides. But what she said, if a man rapes a woman, don't she have a right to abort it? On a normal day, I don't think you have a right to like, I believe he has feels he has stake, like for it not to happen. Yes, you have feels you have to take. Yes, but like you can just take some pills that will prevent it. But guys, don't wait to go about this. Just leave your comment in the comment section. Don't you like share to my channel? I'll see you next time, guys. First.